what's up guys so today i got a, another video for you guys today we're going to be talking about my beta tank and what problems have been happening and an update on a couple fish that i got for this tank to go with the beta as tank mates right now they are in a one gallon triangle view aquarium 12 dollar aquarium at walmart and we decided to give my beta fish a tank mate so Thank you, Fins and Thanks. You know exactly what you gave me, and I'll tell everyone else in just a minute. We're going to go ahead and show you guys, and I kind of redid the tank so it's safe for the things that I put in there for the tank mates and the beta fish to hide and be protected. So let's go ahead and get to the video. So here's the beta, and if you guys are wondering what the tank looks like, I'll show you in just a minute once I get the... Um, the babies show you guys the babies that I got and the babies are baby guppies I have four in here right now I think I have five exactly but I just don't know where he went I had five and I give them more change this morning so there we go and I love these baby guppies because they're really pretty I have two one little white one with a red tail and two like more like minnow looking ones but they are baby guppies and this is the tank set up right now. We have a plant right here and a plant right here. This is more for the guppies. This is more for the beta to hide if he is not feeling safe. And we have this shell that we've had in recent videos. And this shell for the beta to lay on if he wants to. And this shell. Um, we have took out the filter because the beta and the guppies have been getting stuck behind it. The beta is still doing okay. I gave him a salt dip. He's better. And... Um, there's only one of them, but the triangle view makes it look like two is right there. So I kind of have to see on this side, but the baby guppies are right there. They're doing really good. I think the beta has attacked one, and then the guppies have lived and worried about themselves, but they're doing okay. Um, yeah, they're doing really, they're, um, the beta's being really friendly. He's staying still for me, thank goodness. But we took out the filter because they got stuck. And we had to take it out because the beta right there on his fin, right there, um, he was getting stuck. So we gave him a salt dip. He's perfectly fine now, though. Thank goodness. And now he wants food, which I'll be feeding him in the, at the end of this video, so stay tuned. And yeah, I did a water change this morning because they have no filter right now. I'm sorry for the guys that and girls that say you need a filter for betas. Um, my beta, unfortunately, can't survive with my filter. It's very high-powered, and it's only in a one-gallon tank, which I'm planning on putting them in a five-gallon with more p fish. I have two snails in here. I just don't know exactly where they are. Let me look. I don't see them right now, but they're in here. Oh, I found one. It's right there. He is probably just hiding, cleaning up the plant, access food, and I'm guessing the other one's near him. And um, the other one's brown. And we also have these guys right here. These are the pond snails I got from Fins and Things. He donated them to our YouTube, to this YouTube channel. And the free guppies. We got them from them. He's very respectful to our my channel. And I'll be doing a new video and everything about him. So yeah. I'm, and I remember the newspaper background. I've made that. Told you guys in the past videos how I made it. So go ahead and check that out. Here the beta comes. And let's go ahead and do a feed of food. I have been feeding him. I put one drop in there. Unfortunately, my camera decided to stop and not record. So I'm going to drop another one in there. And the betas, the guppies or the betas will eat it. So I dropped him in there. And then I'm going to feed him this mixed food in just a minute. So let's get to it. This food has dried blood worms and goldfish flakes for now. I really don't, I honestly don't have any, um other fish food right now in hand i did but then i accidentally ruined it i accidentally got it wet sadly but there it is the beta and the um guppy share food usually um sometimes the betas want something different so it eats the goldfish flakes um it, the goldfish flakes actually keep the color in them and yeah here they are they're not willing to eat right now the guppy is like sitting at the bottom because if the beta is on top because they don't want to get um, attacked or anything. So they the baby guppies stay out of its zone a lot of times. And the bait, if the beta gets near it, it just looks at it and that's it. So 
yeah. And um, this is just a tank update right now about how it looks. I know I haven't been uploading a lot. Sorry about that. So please subscribe and like the video. I need more subscribers and more followers on my Instagram. My Instagram is fish and others. And if you're not finding it, it's um, Preston and fish and others. And make sure you tell everybody about the, my YouTube channel. Share it and everything. We love having new subscribers. And we're excited to um, get more fish eventually once I get to more subscribers. I will be doing a giveaway on my Instagram once I reach 50 followers. So go ahead and follow my Instagram, fish and others. Thank you guys for watching and have a great time um, for the rest of your summer. To actually, tomorrow is the first day of school. It's a Friday, unfortunately. I was hoping it would be a Wednesday because I actually like school and marching band. I'm in marching band and speech. Um, yeah. So it's exciting for school to start, except the learning, the learning stuff. And I love hanging out with my friends. And having them go ahead and being my friend means a lot to me. So thank you guys, and thanks for watching my video.